In this video, we will demonstrate the super text features in the software. To get started, we go up and click the ABC button on the toolbar, and uh, the text dialog box gets launched. We have some default text here and some default settings. If we click on the Add button, it actually adds a text action to the sequence represented by this uh, white bar that goes from one to five seconds in the sequence. If we click on the play button up here, we will see this text action get played and we see the text scroll from bottom to top across the ribbons. We can of course uh, also change the color of the text. Uh, as I change these color controls, it changes the color of the preview. To change the color of the text action, I click on modify. The bar up here becomes green. I click on play and of course uh, green text now gets scrolled from bottom to top across the ribbons. We can change the rotation and the direction of motion. It will change to 270 degrees and I'll click on down, modify, play, and now we see green text going from top to bottom. We can also uh, choose rainbow colors rainbow button and now we have rainbow text modify play and now we get rainbow text scrolling down across the ribbons we can uh, also um, change the font and the text of course I'll type in the word Mary with an exclamation point and then choose a smaller font and uh, we also have a bigger font. We have a bigger 12 by 12 bold font. We'll use that for now. Um, and let's say we w don't like the way this exclamation point looks. We actually can uh, change the characters within the font. We, uh, it won't let us change a system font, which we're using now, but if we go down and choose a custom font, which is a copy of the same font, um, we can uh, click on font character entry, and now we see that we have can display each one of the characters individually here. We're going to do the exclamation point. Um, right now it has a character cell width of four. We will modify that to six to give us some room to make a bolder, fatter exclamation point. So I'm going to draw some new pixels here like this and now we have a bolder fatter exclamation point. We click on modify and then save. We go back to text action entry and voila we see our bolder fatter exclamation point. Um, and that's uh, at the end of uh, this demo, uh, it, it, we've illustrated some of the basic features of SuperText.